with Bill Owen here on the beach with competitive outcomes. Here's the deal. What is the single worst thing you can do in exhibition drill? And that doesn't matter if it's armed or unarmed because this will apply to both as most concepts most certainly do. The worst thing you can be in exhibition drill is boring. If you're boring, you're not gonna be getting points. Now, what is boring? It's easy to say that boring means slow. Okay, if you're slow the whole time, that's boring. Uh, it's easy to say boring means uh, doing simple movements, perhaps regulation or basic movements as opposed to actually spitting rifles or uh, doing some complicated formation chains, etc. That's easy, that's, that's the elementary level of what boring is. Here's a real definition of boring, uh, and I'll explain it like this. The way your exhibition routine should be constructed, as in, in a way that is going to be anti-boring, thus exciting, uh, is just like an EKG reads on a heart rate monitor. It's got its ups, it's got its downs, uh, et cetera, in between, but if ever it flatlines all the way across, that flat line, of course, means you have just expired. Uh, and there's how your score sheet is going to look as well. Um, now what that means, it's easy to look at it with speed, so I'll start with that. Speed, you've got your fast parts, you've got your slow parts. Of course, there's some parts in the middle too, but no matter what we're doing, we're not going to stay doing that long enough to create a flat line. In other words, if we started off fast and then we stayed fast the entire time, that flat line would become boring. The fact that we were being fast will no longer be appreciated by the judges and they will get bored with it, okay? Fast is good, slow is good, regular speed is good, but unless there's a variation of them, what are we doing, okay? Uh, speed was easy one to look at, you could take it the, to the next level with sound. Something should be noisy, something should be quiet, however it shouldn't be the same all the way across, right? Some things we do in a standard um, box type formation, other things we do in uh, changed, you know, more uh, dynamic formations to change it up and make it different. That is what keeps it exciting. Exciting is always going to score points across the board because once a judge gets bored, once a judge loses interest, they're just going to lowball your numbers. Once they're not paying attention, how are they going to see the cool thing you did because they've already lost interest? Think of it like YouTube, which we're on right now, right? You have ads on uh, most videos on YouTube where you skip in the first like five seconds and you're waiting, waiting, waiting until it finally clicks over and you can skip the ad. But every once in a while, you get an ad that gets like halfway through. You're like a minute into watching a movie preview or something. You're like, oh, wait a second, I can skip this. I forgot. Be the ad that they don't skip. Be the ad that they're not sitting there for the first five or ten seconds going, when is this going to end? When is this going to end? Stay exciting, my friends.